Well, one Chattanooga neighborhood got a weird wake up call late Friday night as city police were knocking on doors. But it wasn't to alert people of a crime in the area, but a chemical leak. News 12 Scott Coral learned two more agencies got involved and spoke to one neighbor who says he saw it all. A quiet Friday night was rudely interrupted as police, fire, and even the EPA had to come out to inspect these dumpsters that were filled with 1955 gallon drums leaking an unknown fluid. It all happened in the 1400 block of Highland Park Avenue. According to the neighbor across the street who didn't want us to show his face on camera, he says two men started coming to the house about a week ago, storing the drums in the dumpsters, but something wasn't right. The barrels were emitting an odor. I won't say like an almond type smell, but stronger. And the neighbor behind, behind there had called call because they smelled the order. Police and fire investigators didn't believe the leak warranted an evacuation of residents, but neighbors weren't so sure. From what I understood, there was a, there was a foamy chemical in them. I did see a leak or something. That's what prompted, what prompted fire trucks, police cars, and then the EPA, they're the ones doing the cleanup. And they said they're gonna, they told me um, it's going to be very expensive to clean that up. Cleanup took most of Saturday and a little bit on Sunday. What for the rest of us would be a major happening in our neighborhood is almost run of the mill here. A lot has happened in the neighborhood. You know, I mean, we had we had an MS-13 gang member lived lived on this block a couple, couple years ago. You know, so seeing police cars or whatever in this neighborhood isn't surprising to nobody. According to city officials, they've told the residents that they'll have an answer as to what the toxin is on Tuesday. In Highland Park, Scott Coral, News 12 Now.